a mild winter so far, December the 15th. A forum I frequent, somebody asked if the bees were more likely to burn through the stores with it being so mild. And the short answer is, um, hard to say. Or if they do, will they be burned through enough that it makes a statistical difference big enough that you could be short in the spring? And um, the only way to really know is to actually have them weighed. Weigh them all beforehand and weigh them all afterwards. I can weigh mine, and I weigh mine consistently every year at, just after feeding, and then it's usually mid-March when I take the... Uh, wooden covers off when we have a warm day and quickly put them on a scale and back again and I find that consistently it's an average of about 25 pounds lost between that period once it gets after mid-march I don't weigh them again I find there's enough to keep them going until the until the dandelions and if there's anything that's um, less than uh, about 40 pounds for a 5 over 5, I might give them a frame of honey, but everybody else is usually pretty good. The um, the only way to find out for sure is to weigh, when data is king. But there's not much else to do around now. I came around today and uh, we've had so many warm flying days that I didn't, um, I didn't reduce uh, any of the alcohols. Oh, well, that's not true. I got one closed off and then one and one completely open and today I've put the half corks in my friend uh, Trevor is um, thinking that uh, you know we don't really know if that makes a difference but he's in uh, the Bahama like temperatures of uh, Milwaukee Wisconsin compared to the the cold north here so uh, you know your mileage may vary and Local differences do make make a difference, and um, what else can we do at this time? It's uh, you know hard to say whether the things, some of these little things we do, um, make the bees perform better or feel better, or they just make us feel better as beekeepers because we feel like we're doing something. You can't overlook the feel good factor of the smug beekeeper.